Hi Yogi, welcome to Autumn Yen. Autumn invites us to begin slowing down, turning inward and reflecting on the changes happening around us and within us. So this Yin practice is your opportunity to intentionally slow down, turn inward and ask yourself what's going on inside me at this moment. I invite you to focus your attention inward and simply observe without analyzing. Allow yourself to feel into the inner energy field of your body. It's the doorway into being. For this class, you will need blocks for sure, but feel free to use any other props you need. We'll start with a reclining bound angle uh, with blocks to support our upper body. So take your blocks, place them horizontally. The first block will land under your shoulder blades and the second block will support your head. So take your time to settle into this pose. You shouldn't feel any pain from your blocks. So we go around, find a sweet spot to stay. Then bring the soles of your feet together. Allow your knees to open out to the side. Rest your arms by your side, palms facing up. And let's stay here for the next three minutes or so. Go ahead, close your eyes. Once you settle into this pose, allow your entire front body to gently open. Invite more space and expansion with each breath. Relax your face, unclench your jaw. Relax your shoulders and arms. Relax your hips and knees.
take another breath. Then we'll slowly come out. Bring your knees together. Come onto your forearms. Slowly prop yourself up. Move your blocks up to the side. And we'll continue with seated bound angle or bat fly pose. So once again, bring your soles of the feet together and make that diamond shape with your legs. So your feet are further from your hips. Allow your knees to open out to the side. From here, walk your hands forward. And then drop everything. Allow your spine to round. Relax your arms, your hands. Drop your head. Drop your thoughts. Close your eyes. Feel your breath flowing through your body. And feel your body from inside out. Notice the simplicity and ease of being in the present moment. Stay with your breath. And keep softening towards the floor.
Take another breath here. And slowly come up. Bring your hands behind you. Feet flat on the floor. Let's pass through windshield wipers. Drop your knees to the left, to the right. One more time. From here, make your way to child's pose. Bring your big toes to touch, sit on your heels, separate your knees slightly. Come forward, extend your arms, rest your forehead on the ground, snuggle your belly between your thighs. And let's stay here. Soften your face. Keep sending your hips towards your heels. Notice how you feel. Physically, mentally, emotionally. Let everything be as it is.
another breath. Slowly walk your hands back. Bring your knees together. Now we'll go for eagle arms. And you can stay here, sitting on your heels. You can take a cross-legged uh, seated position. Or you can join me for a toe stretch. Tuck your toes and then sit on your heels. So choose whichever variation your body needs in this moment. Extend your arms in front of you. Cross your right arm over your left and then wrap your arms and hands together. Eagle arms. Lift your elbows at shoulder height. And we'll pause here for a minute or so. Again, again, close your eyes. Roll your shoulders back and down. Broadening across your chest. And breathe through any tension or discomfort. With each breath, create more space, more ease. Let's take another breath. And then slowly release your arms, shake them out. Untuck your toes, you can come to a rock pose. And then let's switch sides. So extend your arms forward. This time your left arm over your right, wrap your arms and hands, lift your elbows, relax your shoulders down, and pause here. Listen to your breath. Let your breathing be gentle and effortless.
Another breath. And then release your arms, straight them out. From here, come onto your belly. And come onto your forearms. Press firmly through your forearms. Lift your chest up, creating space across your collarbones. And we'll add a half a frog pose. So bend your right knee to the side at about 90 degrees in line with your hip. And we'll stay here for a minute. Keep pressing through your forearms. Now extend your right arm forward. Thread your left arm under with your palm facing up. Rest your forehead down. Another minute here. From here, roll to the right, land on your back. Left hand to your right knee, cactus your right arm. You can look towards the ceiling or to the right. And let's stay here. You can also support your right knee with a block if you need. Soften your face, your jaw. Relax your shoulders.
and stay with your breath. Slowly roll back onto your belly, extend your right leg. Come onto your forearms. We'll go for second side. Bend your left knee to the side, in line with your hip. Press to your forearms. Draw your shoulders away from your ears. Invite that opening across your chest. And soften through your hips. Now extend your left arm forward, thread your right arm under with your palm facing up and rest your forehead on the ground. Slowly roll to the left. Land on your back. Widen your shoulder blades. Bring your right hand to your left knee. Cactus your left arm. You can also rest your left knee on the block.
Relax your shoulders. Another breath. And from here, slowly come onto your back. Center yourself on the mat. We'll finish in Shavasana. So extend your legs as wide as your mat. Rest your arms by your side, palms facing up. Close your eyes. Then take a deep breath in. And slow breath out. Another one, deep, full breath in. And slow breath out. Once again, relax your face. And clench your jaw. Relax your shoulders, arms, hands. Relax your belly. Breathe naturally. Relax your hips, legs, feet. Feel fully supported by the earth beneath you. Relax your body completely. Let it sink into the earth. Rest with your breath.
deepen your breath. Wiggle your toes, your fingers. Move your head side to side. Bring your feet together, extend your arms over your head, have a nice stretch. Bend your knees, roll to one side. Slowly make your way up to a cross-legged seated position. Keep your eyes closed. Rest your hands on your thighs. Lengthen through your spine and relax your shoulders. Take another deep breath in. And slow breath out. When you're ready, gently open your eyes. Welcome back. Autumn is a great reminder that change is a natural part of life. It's always happening. And how we relate to change determines the way we experience our life, to the quality of our life. So take this seasonal change as an opportunity to notice the shifts happening around you and within you. And notice how you approach these changes. Do you resist change in any way, trying to control it? And if you do, can you consciously relax with changing flow, let go of your fears and worries, and embrace the ways you are changing. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'll see you soon.